Hello everybody and welcome to Thai Tiger Reacts, my reaction channel. Today we're reacting to another Marvel Studios trailer for Echo. Echo was in the Hawkeye TV show. She's the deaf chick who does all the sign language stuff and who seemed pretty badass. She was okay. Uh, she had relations to the Kingpin and stuff. But I'm actually now very psyched for this TV show. I wasn't beforehand. I could not have given any flying fucks to this character or this TV program, which is only going to be five episodes long, and they all drop on the same day. I could not care until Marvel Spotlights got announced. It's a branch of MCU stuff, which is all going to be TVMA, Mature Adult Audience. <laughs> well done, Marvel! Fucking finally! We're finally at some point where things get a little grittier because this apparently does have Daredevil in it and it will have Kingpin in it. You know, the deep street level dark characters who have heavy hard hitting storylines. Finally! Woohoo! Finally got somewhere. So let's react to this trailer because I'm very much looking forward to this. Let's go. Okay, so obviously she's deaf. She can't talk. So she was saying, I want something off of you, because he's a vendor, and obviously he was taking the mick out of her. Um, soon now Kingpin's gonna kick his ass. Oh, shit! See what I mean? It's bloody, it's gory, it's hard hitting, it's gritty, I'm loving it. Nice! Okay, whoa, 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 okay, hang on a second, pause a second. So, is this gonna be one of those cases where, like, she's hunting down people that wronged her in the past, we're actually gonna have flashbacks and stuff? Because if that's the case, that's actually kinda. Hang on, is that Dedo? Hang on, is that Dedo? Oh my god, that was Dedo! Daredevil! Anyway, as I was saying, that was Daredevil! <laughs> okay, as I was saying, so it kind of looks like it's a type of uh, series where, like, you see something happening in the past, and then she kills them in the present day for doing something wrong to her. If that is the case, I'm so looking forward to this now. That's a good idea for a character who's very, like, undermined, not very well known, and stuff. And we got fucking brutal shit going on. We just saw, like, a dead body, she's been thrown around, she's throwing people around, and all sorts of crap. the same ah. who's the monster okay okay now that was cool he's got an eye patch so this takes place after the event of Hawkeye because as we know she tried to kill him in Hawkeye All episodes, January 10th, yo. We've only got over a month. Damn, son, let's go. Is that it? Yeah. Cool. Holy fucking Christ. I am well looking forward to this. That was hard hitting. That was dark. The fight scenes look incredible. And I really hope they carry on with that thing where everything goes silent when she's fighting. I really like that little attention to detail. She's a death character. She can't hear nothing. So to her, that's exactly how the fight scenes would go. And if it's going to revolve around her all the time, that's an awesome way to do it. 
It's actually a very intriguing way to play the game. I th play the game. That's a very intriguing way to do the game. You know, the whole thing of a character who has, like, a disability or something. There's obviously deaf characters in several things. Uh, we have the Eternals. Uh, we have the same person in Eternals, actually, in Walking Dead. And things like this. We also have other disabilities as well. I mean, Moon Knight's got split personality disorder. Um... Or DID or whatever it's called now, and stuff like this. Uh, we have we've had autistic superheroes and all sorts of malarkey. So it, it is like a really cool idea, and I think this is gonna do a really good job. I don't actually know if the woman who's playing Echo is deaf in real life. If not, she does it really well. Kingpin's obviously back. That's really cool. Does look like Daredevil's gonna be in it somewhere. Um, it'd be kind of cool if he does get a bit of shine. Not. A lot, but it does look like he's wearing his red suit, so I'm kind of confused on why he's not wearing his new suit, which he got in G-Hulk. Unless they're scrapping that. Anyway, that being said, what do you guys think of Echo? Are you now looking more forward to it like I am because of the whole new spotlight thing? Or are you just going to be the exact same go, eh? Or were you excited in the get-go? Let me know. I'm now more intrigued than I was beforehand. In Hawkeye, she's an okay character, but this is definitely better. Anyway, that being said, thank you all for watching, hit that like button if you haven't already, subscribe if you're new, and hit that notification bell so you guys don't miss another reaction video. We're off passion everybody, and I shall see you guys in the next one. Bye!